Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. If you're new to the channel, I'm Steve Chapman. Today, we are going to open up the brand new, or for the July month, for July 2020, the Warriors Tackle Box. Now, if you don't know about Warriors Tackle Box, um, they have a monthly subscription box. You can buy it actually monthly or you can buy a one-time subscription and you can get this box. Now, one of the great things that they do is that they donate a portion of their proceeds to organizations for veterans. And that is quite impressive. I love that about the Warrior Tackle Supply. I have some notes here. Warriors Tackle Supply's goal is to help out our warriors and to raise awareness for our veterans, first responders, and their families. Donating to first responder programs, veteran support programs, and services to help them take the steps that they, that are right for them. So this is what makes one of these boxes. Now you can pick, there's the other good thing about that, they have a bass box, which is, this is the bass extra large box. They have a standard box, an extra large box, and a pro box. Now the standard box is, I think about 24 bucks. The extra large box right here is $34.99. And then the Pro Box is $49.99. Now, one of the good things about, another good thing about Warriors Tackle Box, if you, when you log on to their website, which I'll put right down here. So for the first month, if you put your email address in there, you'll get some additional things. You'll get a lure, a face mask, a sticker, and you'll save five bucks. So if you want more information, go to warriorstacklesupply.com. So again, this is the extra large box this month. This was $34.99 and uh, like I said, I saved $5 so it was $29. This value of this box is supposed to be $50. So, let's open it, see what's inside. Okay, well they started us off with a Wu Tungsten. I don't even know what you call that. That's the Wu Tungsten pack. It's got some drop shots, some tungsten, some bobber stoppers, and some other things. So, not bad. You can always use extra of those, in my opinion. Next, from Lunker Hunt, is their... Pencil Popper. The Lunker Hunt Pencil Popper. You're My Boy Blue is the color. This is three, three and a half inches and it is one third ounce. And it is a floating, popping bait. You can probably see that from that nose. I'll open it up. I've never seen this lure before, but Lunker Hunt makes some great stuff, so not bad. You can see right there that popping front. Nice rattle to it. Lots of rattles. At obviously extra sharp hooks, because I just got hooked. But nice looking color too. Not bad. Next in the July 2020 box is their own lipless crankbait. This is two and a half, 2.55 inches, depth is 10 to 15 foot, and the weight is 21.5 grams. Who knows what that is in ounces. He's a man, he's, he's actually stupid. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of this kind of stuff, but I understand they have to do it because it saves them money. I will say they do put good hooks on it. They got some VMC hooks, it looks like, but that's a heavy bait lipless crankbait kind of like a rattle trap I have no idea what that stuff is on there I'll take it off but not bad not really happy with that but we'll go over all of it at the end on price and is it worth it next from castaic or castic or however you want to say it it's the CF 50 frog in the sexy color designed with a special bass boat belly 
the Castaic Frog produces a tantalizing side-to-side -side action that turns bass attention towards the surface. Not a bad looking color, take it out. Good plastic, very dirt, very soft. That's not bad, that will actually definitely go in the tackle box. Or technically, Thomas will steal it from me. So not a bad bait too. Next, they sent a Freedom Z-Man Chatterbait. My opinion, you can never have enough Chatterbaits. This one actually has a bullet head. I don't know if you can, uh, I'll take it out. If you've never seen the, the Z-Man Freedom one, this has a bullet head, a little bit different head than the rest of them do. You can see right there, very good hook again. You can see right there, nice, nice thing, good silicone skirt. Um, I would say the only thing I don't like about this is it doesn't have one of the trailers, so you'd have to use a different trailer for it. But everything that Z-Man makes is quality in my opinion. And then, I hope this isn't the last thing. Hmm. From Big Bite Baits, they sent uh, a Coontail June Bug. I think it's a full pack, seven in them. They are made with big bite juice, so I'm not touching them. But little, maybe a little uh, drop shot or something. I don't even know. Never seen these before. Never used them, but look decent. And then they sent a sticker and a face shield. Huh. I'm a little confused. Um, you're going to see this live, to be honest. I'm a little confused about this. I spent $34.99 on this box, and I don't think I got $34.95 in product. And I was supposed to have a $50 value. Okay, I'm gonna cut this here. I'm gonna go back and look up stuff. This is a weird one. I think they probably sent me the standard box. Um, here's why. We're going to go on a rough guesstimate on everything. We're going to say $5 for the pack of, of, of Big Bite Baits. Five bucks. We're going to say, I don't even know, $5 for the lipless crankbait. I think you can get a, uh, a uh, I think you can get a rattle trap like this for five dollars. The Z-Man Chatterbait's probably eight dollars, eight bucks. So we're looking at thirteen, eighteen dollars. The frog is five bucks. Eighteen. That's twenty-three. The Lunker Hunt, I actually went and looked this up in that whole little break. This is actually $5.50. And the Woo Tungsten things are $4.50. Or $6, excuse me. So let's think about this, because I've got it written down now here. If we say the frog is 5 and the warrior tackle thing is five. That is 10. And we say the freedom is eight, is 18. And we say the lunker hunt pencil is five, 50, six bucks. That's 24. We say the big bite baits are five, is 29. And six is 35 bucks. Actually, because now I'm going to be real honest. I can get all of this stuff for $34. I paid $34.99. Now I did get a buff and a sticker. But these shouldn't be included. They must have sent me the wrong box. Um, I don't know what to say here, to be honest. It's a little odd. This is a little awkward for me, to be honest. I, I usually do these live, and I'm really glad that I'm taping this now because I'm really confused on what to say. 
Um, what I'm going to do is probably just wrap this up. You're going to see some different footage of this uh, live. I'm going to I'm going to put the the lures in the um, in the photo booth so you can see them up close and personal. But um, if you want one of these, it's WarriorsTackleSupply.com. Hopefully, you get the right box because this box is not worth the $34.99 that I paid. And I, it's got to be a mistake. So I'll give them the benefit of the doubt. Hopefully they'll see this and uh, can justify it or fix it. So quick add-on here. Uh, when I was done, initially done with this video, I went back and, and really emailed Warrior Tackle Supply to ask if maybe I got the wrong box. But I didn't. I did get the right box. What you see in here is the right box. And uh, I wanted to just go over where I think some of the issue might be. Um, as you're gonna see, I've written down some notes so I can give you exact, give exact stuff. I went to, I tried to stay with one place to buy all these products. If I had to buy these products, what would the retail price be? So in most cases, I went to Tackle Warehouse, which is kind of the industry standard and always has good prices and has most of the stuff. Some of the stuff I couldn't find. Uh, so I went directly to the manufacturer's website to get exact prices. So, as you'll see, the Castaic Frog is $4.99. This lipless crankbait is a little hard to, to do. And here's why. A rattle trap ranges from $5 up to 6 or $7. Um, here's where I value this one. Since this is their own and not an original rattle trap, I'm going to give it at, I'm going to set it as the lowest price rattle trap I could find, which was $4.99. I think that's justified. I would rather, rather have a different color. I'd rather have the rattle trap name. I would rather have everything that comes with rattle trap. Next, from Big Bite Baits, these are $4.49. A pack from Lunker Hunt. Now Lunker Hunt makes two pencil poppers. This one happens to be the Kraken pencil popper. A little bit harder to find, a little bit outdated, but this pencil popper is. Let me look. For forty nine. Now you can get the new one from Lunker Hunt for five dollars. Next, the Chatterbait from Z-Man is $8.49. Now I had to go directly to Z-Man to get this price. And then last but not least is the Wu Tungsten, which is $6. So if we add all that up, let's do it live. If we take the Big Bite Baits, which is $4.49, and we add the Lipless Crankbait at $5, and the Castaic Frog at $4.49, 499 and the Lunker Hunt Kraken at 449 the Chatterbait at 849 and the Wu Tungsten at $6 we get a grand total of 33.46 I paid for I paid 34.99 now I still get a buff and a sticker but that should not be included so here's, here's where I think the problem is. And here's where we're going to differ from, from um, t uh, Warrior Tackle Supply. On their website, they value this tungsten set at $12. They also value this Chatterbait at $10. So if we were to take all of this stuff and go at the very top end and use their logic of retail price let's just do it that way so the big bite baits are definitely 449 there's no doubt about it but if we do 449 and then we go at the top end of the best rattle trap the top end rattle trap is about eight bucks let's just say let's give them the benefit of the doubt and say 819 so we add 819 in and then we go to the castaic frog which is five dollars no doubt about that one 
and then we go to the Lunker Hunt Kraken, and we use that top, the, their, their brand new one, which is five bucks on Tackle Warehouse. We had five dollars to it. And then the Chatterbait, we give them a ten dollar value, even though it's eight forty nine. And then the Woos Tungsten, we value at twelve dollars. We get a value of forty four sixty seven plus the buff plus the the sticker. Is the value fifty dollars? No, close. Yes, but if we really look at real pricing, and if you were to take all these stuff and go someplace and buy them all at one spot or two spots. Um, this is what you'd have to get. Like you'll see, I'll, I, most, of the, most of the stuff I went directly to Tackle Warehouse to get the pricing for because I trust them and it's always good stuff. And then the stuff I couldn't find on there, I went with the best logical one, direct to the manufacturer. I think there was only one that I couldn't go to the manufacturer. Their crankbait I couldn't go to the manufacturer and this Lunker Hunt because I think this is a, an older bait. So I went with a, another one. But you'll see there. So just making educated. This is an educated thing to tell you more about these this tackle supply group. While I think that their their standards and donating money back is fantastic. And I really don't think that this is a bad box. To be truthful, the chatterbait and the frog and the tungsten are all gonna go in my tackle box. And that's that's great. The Lunker Hunt probably is a good pencil, but it's old. I'm always going to use a rattle trap first. And while I think Big Bike Baits is this is a good bait, I'm never going to use this either. But that isn't how this works. But if we look at it from an overall standpoint, an overall value, that's where this is going to change. My opinion on value is drastically different from theirs. I do believe that they're overvaluing their the stuff that they're getting in here. And I think that's the one issue that I have with this. But you want to know what? Make an educated decision if you want to go with WarriorsTackleSupply.com. They are a good company. I will say they did get back to me on an email. Uh, I sent it Thursday or Friday, and I think they got back to me today is Tuesday morning. So, you know, you can't really count the weekend. So they probably got back to me within 24 or 48 hours, probably 48 hours. And that's not bad. I do appreciate that. They did comment and said, yes, I did get the right box. Um... But like I said, I just think they overvalued some of the stuff in it. Uh, stuff in it. So anyway, guys, I hope you uh, appreciate this this video. Uh, nothing against Warriors Tackle Supply. I'm just trying to keep it real, and that's that's the whole thing. Uh, if you didn't notice, the name of the, the channel changed. We are now Get Your Fish On. So thumbs up, comment below, tell us what you think, and hopefully you guys are having a blessed day. Remember to take a kid fishing, get your fish on. We will see you soon. Cheers. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, click up here. If you want to see our last video, it should be right here. Take a kid fishing. Get your fish on. Cheers.